Next act up here, uh, the final of the three comedians from Northern Colorado. Not from Fort Collins. I, I, I think I've got my geography correct. Not Dustin number one, who we've been talking to. I don't mean to refer to him as number two by any stretch of the imagination, but this is a very funny guy, and I've had to see, I've, I've heard really good things about him. Uh, you're going to enjoy him. He's coming to us all the way from Greeley, Colorado. Say hi to Dustin Embry. Come on. All they gotta do is just write on paper, don't they? God. I fucking hate that stereotype. Anyway. <laughs> All right, let's get this back going. <laughs> anyway, I don't do anything on paper, God. Fucking kidding me, I'm a professional. <laughs> <laughs> so, anybody like animals? Yeah. <laughs> Fucking haters, God. You like Chinese food? <laughs> Good. <laughs> okay, so I actually do love animals a lot. And I saw this recent dog show. Uh, anybody watch dog shows? Pretty dogs, right? Applause? Yeah. <laughs> I don't need your sympathy. Anyway, <laughs> but uh, no, actually, uh, there was a Cocker Spaniel that I saw recently through the Manchester Dog Show who got nervous and took a shit straight on stage. Really, took a shit straight on stage. Meanwhile, I can't get my dog to take a crap for 20 minutes if I'm fucking looking at him. <laughs> we see a couple pe fucking dog owners here. <laughs> anyway, uh, my biggest thing is, who's drinking tonight? Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Been drinking so much I can't even find my own drink. <laughs> so, yeah, that's, that's the thing. I'm a drinker. I always drink on stage. And uh, we always have that one friend. That one friend that either is the life of the party, but then after one or two drinks, they got to peel them out of the bathtub, right? So that's gonna be me tonight. Either I'm gonna be the greatest comedian you ever heard, or I'm gonna be menstruating on stage. <laughs> Either way, you're gonna get your money's worth. So, oh, what time is it? Anyway, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so we always have pet names for our significant other, right? Like honey, cutie, sweetie. I have mine, Satan. <laughs> I don't tell it to her face. I mean, who does? <laughs> but I mean, when you call her honey and teddy bear, you like to cuddle with her, and she's so sweet. Well, I call mine Satan, yes. Well, I mean, I make her eggs in the morning and bacon and sacrifice a goat in the morning. You know, kind of, you know, don't hurt me. <laughs> So, does anybody like watch Red Bull commercials? Anybody even drink energy drinks? Yeah. Yeah? Uh, okay, we got one back there. <laughs> We're fucking so extreme. But I actually watch, uh, during, during my break time, I watch not new commercials, Red Bull commercials. They're always doing something extreme. They're like mountain biking off of Mount Rushmore, or they're like, I don't know, fucking, Doing a, oh yeah, yeah, they're uh, skydiving off of a spaceship. Or, what was that recent one? Beating an old woman with her own walker. The extreme stuff, you know? But I work a dust job, and I still drink those energy drinks. So what are they expecting of me? I'm just going to sit there listening to a customer and just swell an energy drink and 
you know, get up and knock a motherfucker out with a keyboard and do a fucking kickflip off the company roof. That's not me. No, 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 no. That's gonna be my two weeks notice. And it's not gonna be fueled by Red Bull or anything. It's gonna be fueled by whiskey. Keep in touch, I'm gonna keep it on YouTube. <laughs> so, uh, let's see. Anybody out? Let's see, married couples tonight, let's see. Let's hear them. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> couples that are couples that are not married. Who's in a relationship? Yeah. <laughs> All right, let me hear the single people. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and the rest of them are dead. <laughs> No, no, no. Um, the thing is, I hit on change regardless, no matter what's going on. I will even choose the pickup lines. Like, I'll, I'll even go through the cheesy pickup lines, no matter what's going on. I could be, I could be thrown out of a bar by like ten bouncers, just kicking and screaming. You know what the fuck you're messing with? Are you from heaven? <laughs> Can you go with, home with me? No, I'm, okay, I've been thinking. <laughs> let's see. No, so, uh, let's see, what's her name? Michelle Keegan, yes. <laughs> that whole paper thing didn't really matter tonight. But uh, does anybody know who Michelle Keegan is? <laughs> no, actually, she did a modeling thing. Uh, she's a Maxim model. Yeah, yeah, definitely look her up. Very hot, very cute. Uh, definitely not in my bathroom tonight. Any guy out here will say, oh, she's not in my bathroom. But uh, you'll find her. So the biggest controversy of her is, is tonight... She had a missing digit. She was one of the hottest chicks on the planet. But then again, she had a missing finger. That was the biggest mystery. And I tried to debunk this. I really did, but it only took me 20 minutes to find out that this chick even had hands. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, where are the couples again tonight? Uh, oh, the good Dustin, yes. <laughs> oh, yes, I am your evil twin. Yes, watch out. That's what my mustache would be if there was one. So, how long have you been together? You, you don't know, six months? Really? It's going to die. <laughs> so, who's been, who's been together longer for a year? Anybody? Can I get a fucking move? <laughs> Put a fucking ring on it. <laughs> anyway, so, I mean, let's see. Hmm. Oh, that's right. So, is anybody like a 90s kid? Yeah. No. No, you're not. I mean, if you're not going like, woo, I'm a 90s kid, my God. But, um, honestly, does anybody remember, like, uh, the real world? Do you? Yes, yes you do. Okay, well, all attention on you, so this is it. <laughs> is anybody drinking tonight? Yeah. Ah, woo! This is an intervention. Keep quiet. <laughs> so, you watched Spirit Award, right? Yeah. Alright, well, I'm going to pitch this show to you tonight. Alright? Does, do you remember, like, when the real world built together the real world? Yeah, let's Road rules is what I'm talking about. Oh, yeah. Yes, real world meets the road rules. It, it, it's the same fucking thing. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah. Nobody really realizes it. But I want to bring a new set to the scene. Kind of combining two shows together. Really, I do. And uh, one of them is uh, Survivor Man. Remember that guy? Yeah. Oh, yeah, of course. <laughs> <laughs> what I want to bring them together is uh, Survivor Man with Jersey Shore. I really do. Really, you, you really don't want to see Snooki get mauled by a tiger? Definitely. Exactly. 
Yes, but then uh, what I really want to bring to stage is coming up on MTV on Tuesday nights, Tools of Survival. Is that not the best fucking title you've ever heard? <laughs> anyway, I'm glad I got that fucking laughter out of that. <laughs> but uh, out of everything, uh, drinks are on me tonight. <laughs> Woo! Yeah! Woo! Wouldn't that be the best fucking thing you heard tonight? Why well, that ain't true? You got that on tape, right? <laughs> Well, uh, other than that, my name is Dustin, and I hope you guys are enjoying, enjoying your drinks tonight. Tip your waiters.